Vice President Harris is now officially campaigning for the presidency. She spoke to a crowd at West Dallas Central High School this afternoon, her first stop on the campaign trail. Tell News political director Matt Smith was at that rally. Matt? Patrick, tonight campaign officials saying they were looking to show a sign of democratic unity around Vice President Kamala Harris, who in just some 32 hours garnered enough support to be the presumptive Democratic nominee. And tonight she is officially launching her campaign for president in this key swing state of Wisconsin. Tonight, the Harris campaign for president is official. Vice President Kamala Harris launching her campaign in Wisconsin, the key swing state she'll need to win in order to win the presidency. The path to the White House goes through Wisconsin. Yes, it does. And to win in Wisconsin, we are counting on you right here in Milwaukee. Democrats emerging from 48 hours of whiplash. The Kamala campaign signs printed and ready to go. Democrats declaring the vice president securing enough delegates to be their party's nominee for president, including from Wisconsin. As the Harris campaign tonight relaunches just outside of Milwaukee with 105 days until Election Day. We have work to do. We have doors to knock on. We have phone calls to make. We have voters to register. And we have an election to win. Harris tonight wasting no time going after former President Donald Trump. And in this campaign, I promise you, I will proudly put my record against his any day of the week. Cheers of lock him up, reminiscent of Republicans in 2016 with Hillary Clinton. Tonight, Democrats putting their support behind Harris in hopes of tightening the race with Trump that many said became unwinnable with Biden. If Joe Biden was in the race, we had a tough fight. It was clearly a, a big battle. I, I think what's moved now is a sense of how do we do this to a sense of we are doing this. Matt, Wisconsin's delegates are among those tonight pledging to nominate Vice President Harris. At this hour tonight, Patrick, more than 90% of Wisconsin's delegates, the state party chairman telling me this evening, of those small number of holdouts, none have told them they are going to vote against Harris. But broadly tonight, we are told she has secured enough delegates across the country to be the presumptive Democratic nominee. Patrick. 12 News political director Matt Smith leading off our coverage tonight.